Hey Hugo Reed, this week for our nonfiction books we have Mako Sharks. All kinds of shark books we've read. So here's a new one, Mako Sharks by Nico Barnes. So he must have done both the pictures and the words because it's only giving us one name. Mako Sharks. Gives us a little table of contents here. Mako Sharks live in the oceans around the world. They are usually found near the water's surface. So they're not deep, deep divers, usually it sounds like. Some Makos live close to shores, others live far out at sea. Makos have large black eyes. They have long pointed noses. This is a long nose, isn't it? Makos are small sharks, but they are strong. So that's showing a fish next to it. And it is not a huge shark, is it? Because that fish is maybe a fourth size. So four fish would be equal to the size of the mako shark. That's not too, too big. We don't know how big exactly that fish is, but still. Here's some more fish back here. I didn't notice those. Did you see those? I only saw that one. Makos are built for speed. They are one of the fastest sharks. Which when you look back at this picture makes sense because they just are so streamlined, aren't they? Everything. The dorsal fin and the tail just are made so that they wouldn't have much resistance to the water when they're going through fast. Hunting. Makos have long skinny teeth. They are perfect for biting prey doesn't look like they have quite as many as sometimes we see in sharks, but they certainly would grab the prey, wouldn't they? They do have some back here too. And they are skinny. Mako sharks hunt down their prey. They bite prey and swallow them whole. Food. Makos eat many types of fish. They sometimes eat squid and sea turtles. That's surprising to me with a sea turtle. You'd think that shell and they're swallowing it whole. That's crazy. Baby mako sharks. Baby mako sharks are called pups. Mothers give birth to four to 16 pups at a time. Pups swim away from their mothers after birth. So they have live babies, right? They don't lay eggs. More facts. Mako sharks are known for jumping very high out of the water. They can jump more than 20 feet high. That is, that's high. That would be, let me think, like as high as Hugo Reed probably. Mako sharks are one of the smartest sharks. If a fisherman catches a swordfish, there's a good chance you will find mako, a mako shark nearby. Mako sharks like to eat swordfish and they are both in the same environments. Hmm. The glossary tells us what some of those words that we already talked about are. And then the last page is those special websites and stuff if you want to learn more about, about Mako Sharks. Whoa, sorry. <laughs> you can take a screenshot of this page. And if you go to it, this, and put in this special password, it'll give you some more information. So that's kind of a cool little bonus. So that is Mako Sharks. See you next time. I hope you have a great week. Bye-bye.